Hi, I'm Anna White and I work as a software engineer right here at Microsoft. I was born without a right hand, but I've been passionate about computers and coding since I was little. Except I never realized how that passion was impacting my body until I had to. Repetitive stress injury happens when one part of the body does the same gesture over and over again, like typing or clicking a mouse. It can cause pain that lasts a day or years. In my case, it was years. Just one year into my dream career, I developed severe burning pain in my left wrist and both of my shoulders. I couldn't hold a cup or brush my own hair because of the burning in my arms. So how could I keep my job? The human body can only click so many times before it can't. Having one hand just means my body hit that limit twice as fast. But I wasn't ready to stop coding. When every click hurts, every click you can save matters so much more. So I dictate Teams messages with my voice. I switched to a lightweight left-handed mouse, and I even designed my own keyboard that sculpts to the shape of my nub, so I can type while barely moving my arms. And I put the enter key on the left side for obvious reasons. But it still wasn't enough. I still had pain and I was still clicking the mouse thousands of times a day. Just like I customized my hardware, my software also needed an upgrade. Visual Studio Code has a lot of features that are awesome for people with motor impairments like me. Firstly, in Visual Studio Code, you can remap every keyboard shortcut. So I can take those keyboard shortcuts that are normally done with the right hand, like Control O, and switch them to be with my left hand. Open a file with Control G. The snippets feature lets you type a short phrase and replace it with a longer phrase, saving keystrokes like my org's copyright header or the boilerplate for our unit tests. Plus, VS Code's toolbar is fully customizable, so you can put the tools that you use the most literally a click away, instead of them hiding in menus and menus and menus. I recently added the GitHub Copilot chat extension to my sidebar, and I reordered it so it's really close to where my cursor normally is when I'm coding. I can switch between them barely moving my arms, which my shoulders are very happy about. GitHub Copilot in general is great for reducing those repetitive keystrokes and clicks, but we can go even further. After downloading GitHub Copilot, I then download the VS Code speech extension and I enable Hey Code. This is gonna let me trigger Copilot with just my voice. Watch. Hey Code, can you fill out the setup of the boilerplate for me? Hey code, what does the setup do? All without touching a keyboard, are you kidding me? Today, my pain's a lot more manageable. I've been able to save enough gestures that my body's been able to rest and heal. And I never had to stop doing my dream job.